Hi, Joy Jules Cruise Companion. Counting down, Disney Wonder coming to Australia. I still have some more thoughts. Do they still revolve around rotational dining? Stick around and find out. get back to me to tell me if every vlog on Disney that I've ever said has something to do with rotational dining. Let's see what I've got to say today. <laughs> Dress code. It's really important when you're coming on a Disney cruise ship. It has a different feel to it so you have to actually pack unfortunately a little better clothing just to get into the spirit of the whole thing. There is a dress code with Disney that isn't necessarily adhered to on other cruise lines that are plying the Australian waters. So does that involve rotational dining? Yes it does because going to the dining room every night is a cruise experience in itself. You don't have to make reservations for dining with Disney Cruise Line unless you're going to the adult only Palo dining. You have your set dining time and your set dining table and that is where you're going to be eating each evening. If you miss that, you've missed part of the show. So because there is a dress code to Disney, your staterooms will be available from approximately 1.30. So you'll be able to put all your amazing clothes into your amazing stateroom so that you can have an amazing time on your cruise. I give the standard guidance to everybody going on any cruise line. Always in your carry-on have your medications and your swimming clothes. Because if you have put your luggage to the stevedores on the dock and they load them onto the boat and they come to your cabin for approximately 1.30, if you need anything like your medications or you want to have a swim before your clothes gets to you, don't forget to pack your swimming clothes underneath your clothes even for when you're embarking on your Disney cruise. How much can you carry for a Disney cruise? Clearly, it should only be about 20 kilos, but because you're going to be packing some of those extra things like your pirate costume, your princess costume, or your prince outfit, maybe your luggage is gonna be a little bit heavier, but don't go overboard. It is important for the little princes and princesses to have their dress up clothes because when they have their photos taken with their favourite Disney character, it would be fabulous if they were in mirrored clothing. Just absolutely fabulous. How much do you pack? Not too much, but do go a little bit overboard because it's only going to be shorter cruises, two, three, four night cruises. So you can pack that little bit extra and don't forget your pirate costume who's going to be the best dressed pirate on your cruise. Don't let it be Jack Sparrow or Captain Hook. He's always trying to steal your jewels. You be careful of that one. Mmm, tricky little souls. So I'm hoping everybody's getting as excited as I am for the countdown for Disney Wonder coming to Australia in December of 2023. This is Julie Jules Cruise Companion, counting down very slowly, trying to stay calm. Stay safe, everybody, and happy travels.